Hi. Hi. My name is Kyla. I am a junior from Burke. Let the dogs out. All right, this is my poem to my father. I need a second to breathe. I need a second to think. They say I need time, but time is what's making me fall to my knees. People say it gets easy, but this is not what I believe. Maybe for you, but for me, my days go to waste, waiting hours on hours for my brain just to be released from the negativity you feed. My mind's out of control. The frightening images you put into my head. Now I have nightmares every night because of you. I built this wall between me and you, where you stand behind it, waiting for a young girl to pass through, where once she passed, she thought she was only turning one year older, but instead she was five going on to 16. You look right past her. You let her go. Now her mind is out of control and she can't even trust you with one word. You don't deserve her respect. Therefore, she still gives it to you only because you're her father and she still loves you. Maybe if you loved her, she'd feel safe or safe enough to share what boys like to say to her. But instead, you say it's her fault. It's always her fault. No matter what she wears, she can never feel comfortable only because you taunt every little thing. I'm sorry she wasn't the firstborn son like you hoped. But she deserves all the love in the world, but where's the love? She doesn't feel it. Maybe stop protecting her because it's not working. She just wants to feel like the other girls who are loved dearly, but one day, just one day, she knew a boy was going to break her heart, though she didn't expect it to be you. Her own father, who she'd do anything for, but when it comes to her, there's nothing you want to do. Until she's a straight A student, and in every varsity team, until she loses the weight you stack on her shoulders. But until then, she's a threat to society. Her weight is disgusting to see, and her crying is just attention-seeking. But she's only 16. Can't you see her pain? She feels like she's dying and nobody is doing anything. Maybe she's trying to get rid of the demons inside, or maybe she doesn't want to deal with the emotional damage you bring. But maybe, just know, she's fighting for her life, not yours. This is not a game, so don't try and play it. You already lost, now give up and let her go away. If you didn't want to raise her right, you shouldn't even have a kid. So if you read this, just know you lost her. She hopes you're loved enough because she's done giving her love away.